the Motion Picture Rating Administration has rated the following W for Whedon's only. Good evening, Mr. and Ms. Whedon, Sandra, and Lick and Lisa, and welcome to SJET. I am going to attempt during the next several minutes to acquaint you with our system and how it works. I'm going to start here in our studio with something you're probably familiar with, the television camera. The television camera has three basic parts, the tripod, the lens, and the electronics. Oh yes, I forgot, the cameraman. Bob, why don't you show Mr. and Ms. Whedon, Sandra, and Lisa how the camera works. Thank you, Bob. As you can see right here, this is the zoom crank. With this crank, the cameraman can zoom into the picture and get a tight shot or zoom out for a wide shot. When he is in tight, he can use this knob on the back of his camera for focus, and he can get the best possible focus. As you can see on the back of this camera, this is the viewfinder which the cameraman looks through to get his picture. He uses it to pan and tilt and adjust his picture for good centering. That's all for now. Thank you. Well, that's it for the studio. I'll see you in a minute in the control room. Hello again. I'm here in the control room next to the production console. I'd like to show you some of the controls here. What, what we do here to produce programs is we have a director, a technician, and an audio man who would be sitting right here who operate these controls to give you the finished product which you are watching now. Let me introduce you to your director, Bob, and he'll explain more about this. Hello. As you just saw, I faded myself in. Now, if I wanted to, I could fade this culprit over no, here out. No! No! Don't worry. I'll bring him back in a minute. This is what we call the switcher fader. With it, we can fade and cut and change cameras as we want. Above it, we have the special effects generator, which we can use to uh, produce wipes and all sorts of things. Watch as I wipe this culprit back in. Oh, boy. Okay, I, we can do all sorts of special effects on this. We can also uh, all produce keys and mats. Up here are our monitors, which the director uses to pick out his shots as he's producing the program. Over here is the audio man station, where he has a mixing console and his tape decks. Okay, uh, I think that's about all for now. We'll be going now to the uh, distribution racks behind me over here. Whoops, I'll, I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> Hello again. I'm standing here next to the editing and distribution racks where we send out our tapes. First, we make them from either our studio source or from off the air, recorded on these VTRs right here. I might add that VTR is our abbreviation for videotape recorder. Later, during classes, we rebroadcast these tapes on any of six channels, three, four, five, six, seven, and nine. Bob here will go ahead and explain a few more details about the system here. At present, we have five VTRs. VTR1 here is recording this program right now. VTR2 we are using as our gin lock source, enabling both me and Bob to be on the screen at the same time. Over here behind me is the proc amp. This is the device which is doing the gin lock right now, the device you've heard a little bit about before. Your guide will explain more later. Over here is the distribution router. Here we send our programs out on those six channels which I just mentioned before. Above it are the tuners, tuners one and two, which we pick up our off-the-air signals from our local stations to be recorded. VTR3 is over here and VTR5. Now for the attendance console. The attendance console is connected to 51 carols upstairs and to 30 classrooms out in the buildings. Uh, there are dials at each of these stations where a student can dial a three-digit number to reach any of ten tape decks right over here. Each of these tape decks has four programs on it, which gives us a total capacity of 40 programs. These tapes 
requeue themselves at the end of a program so that another student may use it. They're automatic. If a student wants a videotape, he dials a number down here, 191, which rings a gong in our attendance console, which alerts us to his situation. He then asks for a tape, and we give it, him a channel, which it will be shown on. That's all for now. Your guy will probably show you the rest. That's all for now. Your guide will show you the rest. So, so long. From SJET Studios.